just wanted to explain where I've been the past two weeks, I would say. So, the day on Monday, when after I finished uploading an episode, I was going to post it after I came home from work that day, my sister abruptly wakes me up and says, my dog spilled coffee on my computer. She was, my dog doesn't know any better. He know He doesn't know not to scramble up on the table to grab food. They're both to blame. I mean, technically, I guess I'm to blame because I don't know how to properly train him out of that. I've been trying. He's not going for it. But also, she knows better than to leave food around when dogs around. Usually, when we have drinks around the computer, it's all fine. But because she had food around, it became an issue. He climbed up, knocked her coffee over. She said she was only gone for 40 seconds. I don't know. Regardless, I reacted as fast as I could, tilted it, hoped for all the coffee to get out, put it in rice for a few days, and prayed it was going to be fine so because of not being on the computer for a few days i had to find a way to occupy my time i have been hardcore console gaming since my computer was presumed dead and one day we're rearranging the room so that you know my brother my little brother has a seat has a spot to sit in while we played mario party and all of a sudden my sister, my sister is like, Val, the computer light is on. I'm like, what? Grab that bad boy, take it outside. And it made noises. The um, DVD port could open, but it wasn't turning on. So I'm like, okay, I'll leave it alone for a few days. I, a few days, a week later, actually, it turned on. I'm like, all right, cool. Shut it off, clean the keys up a bit, wouldn't turn back on again. I'm like, what? Week later, it's on. It's working now. It seems fine. I mean... It makes me nervous to shut it down again, but there's nothing I can do about that. Sometimes it has to shut down for good for a while. And I did so so I could clean the space bar for it because it was sticking. Like I went to the gym, came back, and realized, holy crud, my space bar is just infinitely making spaces. So I shut it down, cleaned it out, and it wouldn't turn back on again. So I had to play with it, power it off, power it on again before it finally started working. I don't know why that's an issue. Oh, hello. That was uh, probably a message from Jonathan. Rose of the Snow. I'll answer that later. But, and so it finally came back on, and it seems to work for good now. I'm currently working on backing up some important files just in case this computer decides to go <laughs> on me. But th that is my explanation for why I've been gone for two weeks. And I don't know, I really haven't promoted my Twitter, but I'll definitely leave a link in the description about where to find me just in case I've been absent for too long. Like, as soon as I could, I posted online about how, okay guys, my computer seems dead, I might not be able to do any videos for a while, and, you know, explaining the situation. But here I am now explaining it to you guys in a video format. And it's weird to say, but... At the same time of getting my computer back and being happy for it back, I'm kind of upset that it is back. I've mentioned before that I suffer from a shoulder issue in my right shoulder where one of my ribs overlapped and twisted kind of around on, well, rotated really on my shoulder blade, making it stiff and problem, and like it, it was very troublesome. And I was going to the doctor once a week for a whole month to try and get it back to where it should be. And I did exercises, and it was there, but it wasn't quite there. However, when my computer fried, forcing me to get out of the position I always was while I was on the computer, my shoulder is miraculously better. I mean, mind you, the first few weeks, I suffered from a left hip thing that kind of repaired itself, but my shoulder has never been better in the two years I've had the issue since my computer fried. And that makes me feel wonderful because I'm no longer feeling uncomfortable. I mean, every now and then it feels a little rotated, but I no longer have to feel that way all the time. And that makes me happy that that issue was gone. So while my computer is back, that means I probably will get that, um, I will get that issue again. My goal is for that to not happen. That means I'm spending a lot more time off the computer and more, console gaming or doing stuff I said I would do in the house in the first place. Like, 
just yesterday I uh I don't know why bugs like to put cobwebs all over my side door, so I kind of sprayed that down. I did things that I said I would do, but I never did because I was so distracted by my computer. I was so reliant on it, which is really bad, and I know it was bad, and finally, it looks like I'm not going to have to do that anymore, and so my goal is definitely to keep up with the videos, but definitely to ease up on how long I'm actually on the computer, and that's pretty much it, guys. Um... I wanted to explain my situation on the why I was gone for so long. I am back though. However, we are going to wait until next Monday to post videos again. And it upsets me to do that, but it's just in case, like a precaution with this computer. I just have to upload um, some work in progress pictures and my mom's pictures of my family on the Dropbox so that it's not so that if something does happen to this computer, it's all backed up. I already have a, I already have a Hero Fleet Valley saved and uploaded already. All my writing. The only thing that's not going to be a big deal for me if I lost is Yu Yu Hakusho Torment Tactics. Just because it's not that hard of a game. I could always just get back to where I was in it in like a night. So, that's it guys. It's a six minute video of me explaining all this. And I hope to see you guys on Monday. I mean, I'm hoping. I, I don't see why not. I asked my friend if there's a chance of it starting a fire, and he said no. So, yeah, it's great to be back. I miss you all so much, and I apologize if you made a comment and I never answered you. It's I didn't mean to ignore you. I swear I did not. I hope you can forgive me. However, I'm back. Feel free to leave your comments about Hero of Lee Valley or Save the Homeland or Magical Melody that you might want me to answer. Alright guys, thank you so much. I'll see you next time. Take care now.